Hello everybody, my name is Craig Bennett, and today I'm going to be answering a quick question and from a viewer. And basically the viewer wants uh, Windows Movie Maker, and apparently with uh, Microsoft they took out Movie Maker, the photo thing, and uh, Messenger, and, and something, some other things. I'll get into that in a second. But uh, real quick, uh, what I will advise before I show you the method is go to the actual one store and just look up and see if what you want is here because you're probably going to find a lot better options here than using that movie maker or whatever it may be and that way you at least have something to edit and most of that's free but let's say that you just really want it back for whatever reason well you can go here and the link will be down below and just press get now and then open that up and then from there, what you need to do is simply, um, like, like from here, we can choose the programs. So like your uh, Movie Maker and, and Photo Gallery, Mail, Writer, Messenger. Now, as far as this goes, I'll recommend that you don't install Messenger, don't install Mail, and really don't install Writer. Because Writer is, um, I don't know if they update it in there. Or it'll be like the next major update, which will be in like a month or something. But there's going to be that already added. And, and I think it already is added. But the messenger is obsolete, I believe. Um, and the mail is obsolete because you already get a mail that comes with the Windows 10. The photo gallery and movie maker is the one thing that doesn't actually come with here. And I think it's because that you got a Windows store and, and there's better options just by default. So with here, just uh, go install and and it will install it. Oh, and one thing I for, forgot to mention is this won't be updated, or at least it shouldn't be updated anymore because um, it's out of date as, as far as you can tell. <coughs> it's uh, from 2012 and it's just not going to be updated. But let's uh, let me show you how to set up as a default while it's doing its thing. So what you want to do is go ahead and go to the uh, system uh, settings and go to system, then go to default apps. And what you want to do is say, for example, like um, photos, what I would do is just select that and it will find whatever I can look for store. Like if it's uh, whenever it's done installing, if, if it's successful, then it should show up here where you can look for more apps and whatever and same thing with uh, that is you can look for more apps um, and one, one thing to mention is you can actually install Windows Media Player uh, VLC or whatever you want um, and, and that way uh, I'll take care of that and same, same with some of those other things um, and, and as far as that goes um, obviously set whatever as a default so so um, that won't happen. But anyways, as far as that goes, I'm waiting to this time before I show you next step. And by the way, uh, just real quick, in case you're trying to get the um, browser, um, if that doesn't work, just switch to the edge and then switch it back to whatever you want, and, and that, that'll take care of that. All right, and right here, we got it done. So let's go ahead and click close that, and uh, let's go ahead and pull up the uh, thing and uh, I think it's movie maker so right there and um, let's see if we get everything good and go and like I said before here uh, just you know select that and 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 um, you can select whatever you want from there and just press it agree and uh, again notes that this stuff is outdated um, it's 2012 right now it's 2017 um you're not going to get an update on this so just just note that it's it is what it is just agree to it and then there you go it's simple as that now as far as this goes what i'll recommend that you do is like i said go through the store and stuff but if that's all you need then that's all you need but anyways if you have any more questions or anything else then feel free to leave that in the comment section or feel free to email it to me and uh, my e emails on the about page or go to techviewsnup and then techviewsnup.com and my email is on the contact us page but anyways uh please feel free to leave a like share and subscribe and i'll see you next video we have a great day